In this video, we solve eight exponential equations. What makes these equations exponential is that they all have the unknown x in the exponent. Our goal is to find the value of x that makes the equation true. Ready? We are lucky that 32 is a power of 2. 2 to the power of 5 equals 32. So x must be 5. In this equation, 0 0.25 is the reciprocal of 4. We indicate this by using a negative exponent. 0 0.25 is 2 to the minus 2. x must be negative 2. The square root of 10 is 10 to the power of 0 0.5. So x equals a half. 8 equals 2 to the 3. So the exponents 3x and 1 must be equal. x equals 1 third. In this equation, we write both 32 and 4 as a power of 2. Comparing exponents, x must be 2 over 5. This equation requires more steps, but the method is similar. Stop the video here and give it a go. Right, using the common base 2, we rewrite our exponential equation. Now we can compare exponents and solve for x. x must be equal to. This equation requires us to play with the properties of exponents. Remember, to multiply two powers with the same base, we add the exponents. 6x equals 4, so x must be 2 thirds. In this equation, we face a difficulty. 30 is not a power of 2. We need to use logarithms. Once you cover this concept and learn what a logarithm is and how it works, you will understand why applying logarithms converts this exponential into a linear equation, easy to solve. This is what we do step by step. We master exponentials and logarithmic equations. Visit mathsadvisoryourdevice.com for more information. If you enjoyed this video, subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell to receive updates. Leave your comments and give us a thumbs up so that other people can benefit from these videos.